the actions that I use when I'm teaching the Level 2 program, but feel free for your child to make up their own actions. Just make sure that you use the same actions every time you refer to that sound. The first sound I introduce is sh for ship. This is the bottom part of my ship, and this is the sail, and this is the clapping pattern. S and H make sh for ship, sh for ship, sh for ship. S and H make sh for ship, sh. Did you notice that I said S and H make sh for ship and not S and H? And the reason for that is that I want to link new knowledge to existing knowledge. Did you also notice at the end I had the child cross over the midline when they were doing the clapping pattern? This is to make sure that you have interaction between both parts of the brain. The next sound is CH for chick. So the symbol I use for that is the chick's beak. The next sound is for three. So for this I just put up three fingers for the number three. For E for tree I use this to make the picture of a tree. When I introduce the split digraphs where the E on the end changes the short vowel sound a, e, e, o, a, to the long vowel sound a, e, i, o, u, the actions change just a little bit. So when I'm doing A for cake, I tell the child that this is my cherry and my head is the cake and I put the cherry on the cake. And this is how the clapping pattern goes. Magic it makes at say A, at say A, at say A. Magic it makes at say A, 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 A. For I for kite, I make the shape of a kite. For O for bone, I get the child to pretend that they're a dog eating a bone. <laughs> for O for moon, we make the crescent moon. For O for ring, they make a ring on one hand and put it onto the finger of the other hand. For O for flower, this is my flower, this is the stem, and my other hand makes the leaf. For K for duck, I have the child make a big beak. For all for ball, I have the child throw the ball backwards and forwards to me. For E for sunny, the rhyme is a little bit different. We make the shape of the sun and the rhyme goes like this. Y at the end makes E for sunny, E for sunny, E for sunny. Y at the end makes E for sunny, E, E, E. For R for car, I just have the child driving the car. And for O for boat, we row a boat. For A for tray, I just pretend I'm holding onto a tray. For O for cow, we make the cow's horns. For O for girl, we just pretend we've got a girl with ponytails. For E for leaf, we make the tree but have the leaves dangling. For A for rain, we have the rain falling out of the sky. For O for boy, we have a boy pretending he's showing off his muscles. For O for fork, we just pretend we're eating with a fork. For O for church, we make the cross on top of the church. For O for coin, we make the shape of a coin and put it on our palm. For O for house, I just make the roof of the house. For O for poor, do dog's paw begging. For O for bow, we pretend to make a bow. For O for book, we read a book. For the I for sky, the rhyme is a little bit different again. We point up to the sky for the sky and the rhyme goes like this. You can sometimes say I for sky, I for sky, I for sky. You can sometimes say I for sky, I, I, I. For oo for screw, we just pretend we're screwing in a screw.